Hello everybody, welcome to Being Civil. In this video, I will show you how to draw shear force and bending moment diagram of a simply supported beam with a point load. We will first place the point load at the midpoint of the beam and then place at any distance on the beam. So this is our beam AB and the point load P is at a point C which is the midpoint. So this is L by 2 and this is L by 2. First you have to know the sign convention for shear force and bending moment. For the shear force at any section of a beam if the force is left up right down it will be positive and if it is left down right up it will be negative. And for the bending moment if the bending moment is like this so the beam will bend like this this will be a hogging bending moment it is positive and for this bending moment it is second bending moment the beam is bend like this and the bending moment is negative so this is hogging and this is sagging so this is the basic sign convention for shear force and bending moment so let's draw the shear force of this beam first I have to calculate the reactions here so this is the RA and RB as the force P is at the midpoint so RA and RB will be equals P by 2 now to the left side of this force that is the AC portion if you cut a section here left side the force is P by 2 upward so at this section the force is downward so the sign is like this and the force RA is P by 2 this is positive so for the section AC it will be P by 2 positive. To the right side of this force P, PC portion, if you cut the section here and take right side forces, you get this RB which is upward in direction P by 2. So you get a force downward here. So this is negative. So you get the same force P by 2 but negative. So this is the shear force diagram. Instead of taking the right side forces, if you take the left side forces you get the same result here so this is RA upward P by 2 and P is downward so upward P by 2 downward P so the algebraic sum is downward P by 2 so at this section left side is downward and so at this section it will be upward so this is a negative shear force same result now for the bending moment bending moment is the force into distance at the supports it is pin support pin support the bending moment is zero and this at this position C the bending moment will be either this force into this distance or this force into this distance RA into L by 2 so RA is P by 2 into L by 2 you get PL by 4 and we see the beam bends like this so the bending moment will be like this so this is a hog bending moment and you get a positive bending moment so this is positive and this ordinate is PL by 4. That's all. Now we will place the force at a distance of A from the left side and this is B. So first I have to calculate the RA and RB. So RA plus RB which is equal to P and take moment about a point A or B let us take a moment summation of moment about P equals to 0 I have taken moment about this point so RA into the distance which is L this is L and P is opposite direction so it is minus P into the distance is B equals to 0 so RA you get PB by L so RB equals to P minus PB by L PA by L so the shear force diagram will be this AC portion will be equal to RA PV by L and the right side it will be equal to PA by L. Now coming to the bending moment BM at C will be either RA into this distance or RB into this distance. So RB into distance B PAB by L. If you take RA you get same result. same result so the bending moment will be P A B by L so in this two equations if you use A equals to B equal to L by 2 you get the same result just we got before P into A L by 2 into L by 2 by L you get P L by 4 so that's all for this video hope you like this video give it a thumbs up share with your friends see you in the next video